Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, you are gonna be tagging along with me today, doing lots of things. I am sure I just got home from Dollar General. I'm gonna share with you what I got for 80 bucks. It's not that much, actually, it's pretty sad. But anyways, if you're new, make sure to subscribe. I post videos twice a week. Whoop, whoop, whoop. It's summertime, so I've got lots of different videos coming out and I'm excited about them. So, here we go. All right, so I spent $80. A Dollar General. Mommy, I almost you All right, so I did a grocery haul like a week ago, and we still have plenty of stuff. I'm gonna try to do shelf cooking this week, so I just ran to Dollar General to get some snacks, stuff that we need. Um, I got three different small things of LaCroix. Um, I would get the big ones, but we don't have that around here. I have to drive in like 30 minutes, so I got the coconut. I got the lemon cello and the lime, and I've been making a really good summer drink, and I'll share that with you later. Super yummy. Cheese sticks, because my kids love cheese sticks. They're not expensive. Apple juice, I like to mix this with water, give it to my kids um, in the summer. I grabbed these, I thought that they looked good. Sonic Zero Sugar. Try those out with a sparkling water. Um, we needed coffee, so I grabbed the McDonald's coffee, which is really good. I grabbed another thing of bread because my kids have been loving butter toast, peanut butter toast for breakfast lately. My kids love these fruit and grain bars. I always try to buy off brand. Same thing, uh, Big Newton bars. They, I don't know if they've had these, but I think that they'll like them goldfish I've tried to buy the whales my kids don't like the whales so we got to get goldfish and then two things of cinnamon brown sugar cinnamon pop tarts these are like a dollar the dollar general brand and then of course $25 for pampers size six we are almost in pull-ups so actually I could have probably bought pull-ups but anyways hold on my kids need me Okay guys, Father's Day is right around the corner and if your husband loves coffee like mine does, then this gift you have got to get him for Father's Day. Trust me, it is so good. Ta-da! New coffee maker. Let me say that I'm also super embarrassed of our coffee pot. This thing is about two years old. Look how dirty can't get this to come off either. I have tried vinegar, baking soda, all of the things. Disgusting. Ew. We're gonna throw this away. Okay, I'm gonna link this coffee pot below. This one has a lot of cool features um, that I like to have in a coffee pot. My previous one had nothing extra and I find that these features make it helpful. It comes with a 12 cup um, coffee pot the main cabin for the coffee pot and the inside has a reusable filter so that you are not wasting money buying filters it has a knob to turn it on minutes hours you can program it ahead of time and control the strength of the coffee pot here is the coffee pot really nice looking I like that this one is much skinnier sleeker design you can fill this up with 12 cups of coffee so it's really good to serve guests you can also program it 24 hours ahead of time so in the evening before bed you can program your coffee to start it's one of my favorite things about coffee is waking up and it's already done and I don't have to make it the coffee pot is also going to keep warm for two hours after making the coffee and after that it will shut off so you don't have to worry about turning it off I just recently mentioned the coffee filter you can use it reuse it many many times you don't have to waste and buy coffee filters any longer so it saves you money that way it also has an auto pause so whenever you pull it out of the coffee pot it's not going to keep dripping it's going to keep it clean for you and the last thing is that it has a hole to store the cord so that whenever you store it under the cabinets all of the cords aren't getting tangled up and last but not least there is going to be a giveaway linked in the description box with the coffee pot make sure to click it and enter the giveaway one of you could be getting one of these coffee pots for free i will also link the coffee pot down below yourself so you can check it out buy it if you would like let's make some coffee
I'm gonna just put on a little bit of BB cream, mascara, lip gloss, and do my brows, and then I'll be back. All right, now I'm ready. Not that much done, but it was really quick, really easy. And that's how I do my makeup in the summer. I will link it all down below if y'all wanna know. So much dishes. Do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on, I put my feet up, and we just sing along, and I can't help but feeling just loving. All right, I got the sink clean. Something that I clean my countertops with to help save money is water and vinegar. I'm trying not to buy like household cleaning products except like Lysol wipes, you know, laundry detergent, stuff like that. So I'm doing vinegar and water. Sometimes I have to, I have to make sure that this is the vinegar. And candy is the best, and I like it. And I like that. And I like it. I have to make sure that this is vinegar and water because I do have a water spray bottle just like for the cat. Okay, so I'm gonna clean my counters. My counters are black. It's nice because it hides dirt, but it's also disgusting because you can't see dirt. So I'm gonna clean um, with vinegar and water and then I'll try and link these down below. These are really, well, these are getting old, but they're like little bitty cloths on Amazon that you can clean stuff with. Um, I really like them.
All right, it is nap time. I've got to get some work done. I am going to um, make a drink. This is my current favorite cup. So in the morning I do my coffee. In the afternoon I usually do some sort of like beverage with um, inner like caffeine in it, like to wake me up. So this is called Biome. All right, this is a pre and postbiotic powdered drink that you take daily. It has caffeine in it, but it puts good bacteria in your gut to help with bloating, digestion, curves, cravings, um, and helps with like stomach aches. And I take this every day. I really like it. I will link it down below, um, discounted for y'all. And it, it's like a watermelon raspberry, which I don't like raspberry flavor. Okay, but it's really good with a sparkling LaCroix. I usually do it with lime. I'm gonna try it out with coconut. So, let's see. Oh yeah, it smells good. Coconut just reminds me of like the beach. Okay, but gonna overflow if you, you have to let it sit for a second. All right, then I take my frother. I'll link this down below too. It's really, really awesome for froth, but you can also mix drinks. And just make sure all of the powder is mixed. Oh yeah, kind of tastes like a raspberry pina colada. Oh yeah, that's good. All right, so I'm gonna drink that. Try not to fall asleep because right now is when I would want to take a nap in the type part of, like the part of the day. So I'm gonna pay some bills, stuff like that. Then I'm gonna try to do some laundry and I kind of want to clean out my car. Now I'm gonna do one more thing here in my kitchen. Um, I've got to make some banana bread or something. All of the fruit we're eating for the summertime is attracting flies. Flies are all over my sink in my kitchen, even if there isn't fruit here. But I have discovered a trick. I actually did this last summer, totally forgot about them, rediscovered them, and they are magic. I'm gonna go grab them. I'm gonna link these down below. These are like clear um, <laughs> little fly traps um, that you put on your window. So it's really easy. This um, little white strip, so we'll sit right here, you peel it off, okay? Stick it on the window. I put it right here, push it. And then you take this white paper and you peel it off. And it's sticky and little bitty flies fly onto it somehow, I guess like the reflection and uh, catch all of your flies. So if you have a bunch of flies, then I would definitely Try these in your kitchen. Mommy, this is sticky. It is sticky, good job. That's a really big word for you. Mm. And now I'm gonna light a candle. This one's old, trying to use it up from Bath and Body Works. It's actually from like last summer. I put this one over here. And then this is my favorite candle of all time. Definitely worth the price. It's called Oh Hot. I don't know what it's called, but it's Bridgewater Candles. Want some chips, Sybil? All right, so I am not cooking tonight. We had leftovers for lunch, which was like a hodgepodge of like hot dogs, uh, beans and rice, sloppy joes, stuff like that. I've got a ton of um, pulled pork baked potatoes. Um, 
there was a fundraiser at our church for the kids going to camp and I bought some of these for us to eat for the next couple of days. And look how yummy. Except my butter's melted. Anyway, so I'm gonna eat one of these um, right now. I just want you to know that it has only been 24 hours and look at that. Bugs are stuck. This little side that I made was super yummy, okay? We did spaghetti tonight. This is one large cucumber, one little box of cherry tomatoes that I cut into fourths, a little box of feta cheese, and one red onion, olive oil, salt, and pepper. Oh my goodness. So good. My kitchen is clean for the night. Letting my little friend here do some cleaning for me. This is the Yeedy. He's awesome. Um, I'm going to get the kids to bed. Make sure y'all check out the link down below for the giveaway for the coffee pot. I will link the coffee pot down below too. Father's Day is coming up and it is a great gift if your husband likes coffee. Surprise him with a fantastic coffee maker. Um, I know that my husband loves those types of things. All of the video details will be linked down below. I will see y'all in next week's video. Bye everybody.